Well, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night, Twitch chat. Welcome back to Let Us Play. I'm your host, Father Evan. It's good to be back with y'all today, and I have some good news and some bad news. We're going to do the bad news first. My brand new CPU is fried. My computer just... Mm. I went to turn it on and it went... Sir! And it won't turn on again. Uh, I'm so deeply disappointed. So in the meantime... I've contacted the the companies I'm trying to do replace parts because it's all under warranty, fortunately. So it will it will work in the end, but it's like ah, oh, it just got the thing working. At least that explains why he was b sodding all the time, I guess. Uh, so I love you. But the good news is I can still stream and play Minecraft. I can't do everything else because this. PC doesn't have that, and it's not really capable, but I can do Minecraft on it, so I can still stream today. The worst case scenario tomorrow, we turn everything into a Minecraft stream. <laughs> oh, man. And this... The way it works on this computer to play it, it, it's like, it's held together by glue and prayers, which is great, but, oh, it's rough. So, but it's good to see you, Brayherd. Good to see you, Brit. Uh, Brayherd, you have claimed the crown first to him on this, the day of disasters. St. <laughs> Jude, pray for us. <laughs> Let me see if I can get Minecraft working. What? <laughs> CPU should be stewed, not fried. Oh, that was my mistake. Did that fix it? No, that didn't fix it. Why would that fix it? Because it's clearly capturing the whole of the screen. And then when I open Minecraft. It's clearly not. Now learn, learn to cook. Need to learn to cook my CPU correctly. Let him cook. Step zero. Thank you for the 300 bits on this, the day of disaster. Uh, hold on. I'm gonna try coming back here. I swear I had this working perfectly cromulently before I went live. I need to embiggen it. I'm trying to embiggen it. Okay, before we go anywhere else, I will I will spin the wheel of pain. Cause that I can do here. Tahin Gummy Bears! Somehow I thought I'd be out of these by now. Okay. So this is the screen we want for Minecraft. Oh my gosh, it worked. 
It worked! We're taking it! I have to play like this today, though, because of that, because it's on the monitor over there. Oh my gosh, everything's going wrong! Uh, my life is full of chaos and it's a disaster. It's that or I play on itty bitty mode inside OBS. Rotata! Oh, you want a disaster? I didn't even prepare a Rotata because I was so busy dealing with my computer. <laughs> I can only laugh at this absurdity. <laughs> Oh. And you might be saying, well, why don't you just reinstall your old PC? It's like, well, then I don't I don't have a, a Windows key for it anymore because that's saved in the new one. Yeah, the first, I went to Mass. I know, I, I heard the readings. If you've ever been to a Catholic wedding, odds are you've heard the first reading today. Love is patient. Love is kind. Also, look at that. It's a map of the church. Oh, the tahini is spicy today. Why am I going over there? Um, but the love that Paul's talking about, I mean, yes, we can talk about how we can be that to each other, and I think that's good and wonderful, and that's why it's at weddings. But it's inherently, he's talking about God's love. And how God's love never abandons us. What am I doing? I, I'm so discombobulated. Having a broken computer that is your baby really messes with your brain. Throw all of that in the furnace, I guess. If love equals true, then kind patient equals true. <laughs> Ah, man. I've never thought of uh, translating the letters of St. Paul into coding. Although I suppose that's really just logic right there, but... Yeah, we're going to need way more stairs to complete a tower right now. Yeah, I wrote to the motherboard people and asked, you know, for help slash a replacement. And they're like, hmm, have you... It wasn't, have you tried turning it off and on again levels of unhelpful. But it was pretty darn close. And it's pretty funny because they're like... On the one hand, they're like, oh, you need to do... Have you tried doing this thing where you, you know... Just don't have it plugged into anything. Okay. I can't use flying mode. If I try to change modes, it gets upset. It tries to switch my windows. No, but it's like... And then it, so like, it's obviously, it's good stuff. Like, it honestly really is good advice. But then it's also like, have you tried 
doing this extremely technical thing, and it's written purely in technical language. And it's like, you know... You should be able to use flying mode, Step Zero. But you know, is this as if this uh, stream didn't need another disaster? Oh, good, you have multiple work to do. Is it will distract me from his suffering. No, <laughs> Burkadoos are great. Lay them on us. Okay, so I want this one. I don't know how to use flying mode. That's a feature you can turn on and off. Good afternoon. It feels like a Wednesday for, for sure. It feels like a Wednesday of disaster. Heart of Mithril, good evening. Okay. So what I need to do is what is facing this way needs to go here. I think. Yeah. Because that, that panel styling always faces towards the center. Which means this one needs a, a block on top. Oh, that was close. When church, how do you know when to, when you're crossing in front of the altar and uh, went to genuflect? I'm late. Did I miss a Rotoda? You've missed a disaster of a Rotoda. Because this whole stream has been a disaster. Um, Generally, just the good rule of thumb is to, if you're in motion, bow. If you are entering the sanctuary space as part of a procession and there's a tabernacle, genuflect. Also good to see a Nana Kit. You'll be lurking on a work trip to Istanbul. Ooh, very nice. So well, I hope you have fun. What's wrong? Uh, my the CPU on my brand new PC just fried itself. Like I, I adjusted one thing inside. I went to turn it on and it the the power button went blue for a moment and then it stopped and now it won't do anything. What was wrong with Rotoda? I forgot to prepare one because of all of uh Trying to work on my PC, I didn't have time. <laughs> also, because of how I'm doing things today, because I'm playing this on my streaming PC, um, which is a decently capable PC, I'm not going to lie. Like, it's why I bought it. To, to handle the streaming, but at the same time, it's like, oh, this is not ideal. Because, <laughs> like, I have my hand on my desk over here. I'm looking at the monitor over here. I have my keyboard on my lap. Something, something, Birdhouse is in your soul. That is a good album. Blood is a good album. Do you not have enough fans in your PC to keep things cool? No, I was it was a fluke. I think it, it shorted out. It wasn't a matter of temperature, because I had been monitoring the temperature 
And I have a pretty beefy uh, liquid cooler on the CPU itself, so... Like, fairly certain that wasn't the issue. But I had also been experiencing those uh, blue screens of death. And with that, the, the error logs were saying a message that tied it pretty closely to the to the CPU. And I had done some research on other things online, and I thought I had solved it by updating the BIOS, but... Because that's what I did yesterday, and it worked fine. And who knows, maybe it's because when I mess with something, I just touched the computer wrong, and it got contact with the case in such a way that caused it to short out. Because... <sighs> a thing that can happen with PCs. Uh... Nah, I don't need you to mail me a fan. The, the CPU cooler itself... Uh, the radiator has three fans on it. The front of my case has two fans. Uh, the back of the case has a fan, and the GPU has three fans, so that's six, nine, nine fans in total. But I might cut stream short a little bit early today, just to do more maintenance work and see if I can solve the issue based on the emails that uh, tech support has sent me. Okay, so... The outer ones... Should have the extra block. Right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do bishops sometimes always wear gloves during ordinations? Uh, because uh, gloves are a old form of uh, pontifical regalia, as it's formally known, basically fancy bishop clothes uh, that they would wear. It's actually been abrogated. They really shouldn't be doing it, as far as I'm aware, but... It's basically because it is a more solemn occasion, as in, of a higher... Because sometimes in America, when we hear the, the term solemn, we think, oh, more dour, more downcast. Like, no, no, no. Solemn in the church is more joyful. Well, I believe you if you say you've never played Minecraft. I will believe you. Because it is a very popular game, but not every human being has ever played it, and that's okay. That's that level done. Let's remove all of these. I can take a look. I thought your I thought your cell was very monastic, Brayherd. 
It's actually not a bad idea of what I can show chat today with my more limited controls. Oh, why are you right there? Jesus is Lord is followed. Amen to that. Welcome to the channel. Thank you for the follow. Ow. I think I'm just going to have to let the one that's hanging out in there evaporate, unfortunately. Um... What's the channel, Brit? Fantasy Forged. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Three brothers who do a bunch of stuff. Cool. I'm trying to think if I've heard the name. It sounds vaguely familiar, but it's also one of those where it's like... It sounds like a lot of other projects. I mean, fantasy and forged, you know, just... So it's hard to keep track sometimes. Um, oh, one thing is uh, we are very close to 300 followers on this channel, which is awesome. Big thank you to all of you. Um, I want to do something to celebrate that when we get there. So, you know, if you got some ideas, drop them in the Discord. So I'm trying to think of what might be a fun little bonus stream. And then... Um, the two-year anniversary of the stream is coming up as well. Which is wild. Uh, and so just like in the first year when we built this, the Door to Darkness, I want to build another thing. And I was thinking since year two had all the candy, all the weird candies be introduced. Um, I would do, that's like uh, kind of a Willy Wonka-esque candy shop. Whoa! The passage of time. Tempest Fugit. Tempest Fugit indeed. I believe Brayherd's cell is around here. Ah, there it is. I like what he's written. Your cell will teach you everything. Very classic uh, Byzantine comment about the cell of a monastic. And then the Pascal Traperion, Crisis Risen from the Dead, Trampling Down Death by Death. I was just thinking about getting some new candies last night. Yay! And then the Trisegion, Holy God, Holy Mighty, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us. And I believe this is also the Trisegion, but written in Arabic script. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I heard. No fear in that, yay. <laughs> yeah, you've got a nice little soul. You don't have a bed. You need a bed. Because that's what helps you sleep through the night. Yes, I know you have lots of candies. I'm terrified. 
Especially when you put quotation marks around it. I really should build a bridge here at some point. Like, actually connect to these parts. Good question. I don't remember. <laughs> I think I just put into Twitch Catholic to see what would come up in terms of, like, channels to start connecting with more and um, networking and whatnot, and yours came up. And I was like, yeah, all right. <laughs> Help, I'm, I'm lost. Mel, good to see ya. It looks so pretty. Yeah, I don't remember if you were live when I followed, to be honest. I legit just don't know. The Drasegion in Latin alphabet. Oh, I am so not reading that out loud. Oh, a traitor. Tulips. Bucket of puffer fish. That's a surprisingly not useful thing. However, I kind of like the glowstone, but not. Excuse me. Ow. Ow. Need cut. When I say I know random religious phrases in Arabic, it's not the same ones as most people know random religious phrases in Arabic. That's fair. stacks that should be fine for now where are my top three favorite hymns uh oh come oh come emmanuel uh come thou found and lead us great teacher paul Yeah, a lot of people don't know the last one if they've never really spent time at Apollos Parish. 
Um, it is... The exact origins, I, I have not really found a solid answer to. But it is a hymn, basically, uh, directed towards Paul and the Trinity. Um, and it's really nice. It's just kind of a class. It's the Paulist anthem. It's what we sing, basically, at any gathering where we get together. I think my mom really wants eagle's wings at her funeral. And she specifically mentioned that one in some capacity. All mortal flesh keep silence. Oh God, beyond all praising, that's a good one. Pure Nazis in Bethlehem. No, no, not the use. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Nana Kit. But I, uh, I like come thou font so much that it, I had it at my ordination. Oh, that's that was stuttering. That was weird. fell off. That would have been bad. One, two, three, and a slab. One, two, and a slab. One, two, and a slab. So I had a really weird t dream last night, Twitch chat, that I've been talking about with people. I had a dream that I went over to Fifth Avenue and there were just tons of tattoo parlors. And I proceeded to get several tattoos, including and not limited to shaving the side of my head and getting a whole can of Dr. Pepper tattooed on the side of my head. And the weird thing was, I think you might be saying, Father, wasn't that already the weird thing? No, the weird thing was that every one of them bandaged up the uh, the tattoo with a live fish. A live fish under the bandage. I think you could have chosen a better soda. I mean, speaking of better soda... My 12 pack of uh, hop tea arrived. I'm so happy. Also, there's a second 12 pack. It's over in the other building. Um, it's uh, it's the variety pack. I'm happy. I like hop tea. Uh, how do I finish this one off? Oh right, I top this one off with stairs.
I like Dr. Pepper. I don't think it's the best soda. Because cream soda exists. Or since I'm in New York, I could go get an egg, egg cream, which has neither egg nor cream in it. Did the pack have an Oktoberfest? I don't remember. Oh, did I get a pack of Oktoberfest? No, I haven't bought a pack of Oktoberfest. There's only so much hop tea in a single sitting, A, that I can justify purchasing, and B, uh, have space for in my office. I know my office looks bigger than it is on camera, but... Were the tattoos cool? Mel, one of them was a can of Dr. Pepper, and that's the one I remember the most. I wish my office was bigger on the inside. I have so much room for activities. My subconscious really wants me to get a tattoo. I mean, maybe. I was talking about tattoos at dinner that night, so I, I think that may have been an influence, but still. And I think all of them were free, too. Like, I think because they were essentially a sponsorship, like, I was getting paid to get these subpar tattoos. I just looked up what an egg cream is. What in the unregulated food service? Yes, that is when it came about. Look, it's just chocolate syrup and uh, seltzer water. And something else, I think. I forget. The moral of the story is it's a thing that's been at a New York deli counter since like the 1920s. That's right, there's milk in there. What, you don't want to try a little carbonated milk? Cowards. Tell you what, Steps Zero, next time you're back, we're going to go get egg creams. It's like why Russian, except bad. So my first boss ever, I was in high school. I worked at an amusement park. And... Did you just use the phrase, I, I bet... Your mom used to drink milk and Pepsi together. I'm terrified and curious. We call that pill. I thought that was pink milk.
I remind you that an ancient semi-fermented fish that smells so bad at their building is sold annually out of bulging cans. Yeah, fair dinkum. Huckleberry cream liqueur. Could they not have come up with a worse name, though? Pilk? Apparently a Utah Mormon thing. Uh, drink soda mixed with creamer. Okay, but it depends on the soda. Because, like, if you do that with, like, an orange... Ow. With, like, an orange soda, you get... You know, orange cream soda. Also, Utah has a weird obsession with soda pop because it doesn't drink alcohol. There are independent... There's basically bars that serve uh, custom soda. It's the only way I can really describe it. Alcohol or coffee. Also, the soda shops are called Dirty Soda. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Dirty Soda. They do it with Coke, Dr. Pepper. Ew. No. Like, an orange soda to make an orange cream soda. It's like, okay, that makes sense. Cr Creamer is a low-calorie floater. I'm horrified. You can buy beer and wine on Sunday and before noon. Wow, things are getting wild in Texas. Uh, I'm getting out of hand. Just wild parties everywhere. Oh, did the TikTok teens discover a Coke float? Oh, that's so cute. That's okay, I'll let the farmers keep their coke. spot I think I already had the scaffolding.
Although I don't know how I'm going to get to the top. Do I want more pizza or do I just think I want more pizza? Por que no los dos? Also, I think you should have a pumpkin blondie. Am I going to watch the Minecraft movie? No. I haven't even watched the trailer yet, and I know I don't want to. Wait a minute. Oh no. Wait. Hold on. What? But Jack Black, but I don't care. I screwed up on this tower that I'm staring at. It's middle section is alternating on the wrong path, I think. Because it's, yeah, because it needs to start with the gap in the middle. Oh, consarn it. But what's weird is its other side is fine? I think? No, no, it's messed up too. Okay. So I just... We need to put a pin in that. We're not going to fix that right now. And I need to not make the same mistake here. Because I almost did. That's what caught my attention! Meow. Uh, the money that resulted in people thinking a Minecraft movie would be good is called Money. It's a very classic one. Oh, good. Kid is also cheered with 300 bits. Yay. Oh, boy. Thank you for the 300 bits, Kit. Uh, I will get to that in just a moment. I need to sort my brain out a little. watch a bad Jason Momoa movie? Don't go slandering the Fast and the Furious. Oh, the new one. Oh, okay. That's... I thought you just meant in general. What? Did he just turn invisible? He did. Okay. Sorry. Let's transition back to here so I can do the uh, Wheel of Pain. Oh, the Swedish toffee fiber candy. Oh boy. Um, we'll come right back to that. I need a quick bio break, so we're going to just take a quick ad break. Uh, so go stretch your legs, get a drink of water, do what you need to do, and we'll be right back.
All right, I'm back. Uh, did we all forget about the Swedish toffee candy? Yeah, good. I, I can move back to Minecraft. Andy is needed. You know, I was thinking, Duncan, Idaho is a terrible name for a knockoff pastry brand of Duncan Hines. Weak. Streets with benefits. Why did I do that to myself? It sells... Just wait until it's Salmiak. Salmiak's weird, but like... I don't hate... It's a, a texture I don't like for the most part. Chocolate's just bad chocolate. Oh, they jumped in the fire. Oops. One less llama. I can taste the fiber, that's not a compliment. How much fiber per candy? So... One bag is 65 grams, and per 100 grams, there's 50 grams of fiber. So roughly half of a thing is just fiber. Let's just say it's like sad chocolate. And yeah, the uh, Minecraft sounds running in the background during the commercial break. That's why I, part of why I use two computers. Also, for this very instance, is why I use two computers. Why is it taking on the texture of gummy candy? Why do I ask questions? That would be the fibers breaking down. Oh. I already get a healthy amount of fiber because of the amount of vegetables I eat. I like vegetables. Fiber can become gelatinized. Typically, you need, you know, gelatin. And now it's stuck in my teeth.
why. Like, it's all stuck between my teeth and my cheeks. And my cheek on this side. Like, it's just, like, stuck there. Ooh, free lava! gonna leave one side of this section up here open so I can enter and exit. Bah, scaffolding. Back in my day we used gravel or sand and we liked it! We've got better tools now, Grandpa. So if I screwed up that one, I think I also screwed up that one. Hard to tell at this distance. But if I'm looking at these lower ones. Wait, did I screw it up? Oh no, I screwed up this one. I screwed up this one. This one's fine. So this one should have the gap at the bottom. So. You know that thing I said I was going to do? I didn't do it. I didn't leave a side open. Oh well. It's not hard to fix.
then it's one, two, three, right? Because it's definitely... Yeah, because it's one, two, three, one, two, three, and then one out each direction. So this... out like this. Hollow at the center. No. It's not how you go. I feel like it's too tall, but it's also hard to tell is where flying would really come in handy. But again, if I do that, it brings up the whole switch. The uh, screens button instead. Because Windows has decided it's more important. That leaves just one tower remaining. And also it fills in this gap. Because you see how it's wide open in here. There is still a slight gap because of the alternating pattern, but it's a lot harder to tell, and I kind of like that. So one thing I need to do is I need to go get more sandstone, I think. I need to bake more at least. So we have four ovens available. Go check out how the tower looks from behind. Good. Looking good indeed. get some chicken eggs, I think. 
because there's a good amount of chickens living up and over on the hill here. And I wouldn't mind starting a chicken farm back at the main base. You can barely see it. There are tons of eggs in a chest and probably a few in the pen back at the abbey. Okay. How many diamonds do you want for that? We don't charge for things like that. No, but you'll take a charitable donation. change the color of the sky by turning my head. Orange, blue. Orange, blue. Bad Roxy is redeemed a father joke. Roxy, do you know how uh, I come to stream each day with some pep in my step and and a sense of good cheer, you know how I do it? I have a bowl of Cheerios every morning. I'm buying you a button calendar. <laughs> Do you not like my puns? What if I told you that actually came from a pun calendar? Don't help him. No, please help me. I can't always come up with them on the spot. take nine. Nine diamonds. Do I have any wood? No. At least not here. I have some at the church, I think. You're not sure where the eggs are? That's okay. I'm sure I can find them. May you offer me an egg in these trying times. Yeah, I can use these stripped logs to I'll make a boat and I'll need to make some fences at some point as well but well let's just do that while we're here 
and a gate. I'm going to take a bed with me too, just in case this takes a while. I'm bad at making puns, but I will gladly outsource them to others. There you go. I have never noticed that massive cavern right there. That's really cool looking. Looks like uh, something bore into the earth there. I suppose I could have used the uh, portals to travel there, but... Hey, Blackjack, good to see ya. Uh, day's, day, day's been going. My uh, The CPU on my gaming computer crashed, so I'm now playing on my, my streaming PC, which is, you know, fine, but it's not ideal. <laughs> Eggs. Egg. 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 Not egg. It's your cows. Where do you keep your chickens? Bye, chickens! Whee! Splash! Around the back of the scriptorium, why? Where do you keep your chickens? Fair enough. That's an ominous dark hallway. But if I follow the torches, I should get to the other portal. Ooh. Maybe not? I thought that's where...
thought that was the point of the torches. It was to lead to the other portal. Ah, here's where they go. Maybe? Just kind of terminates? You just go overland? No! We are already here. Back to this portal. That's dead end. It's not the scary hallway. Yeah, I remember constructing these or placing these torches to make a path. gonna look up and over this ridge and if there's nothing here I'll go overland oh there's nothing here This would have been convenient, though, because this would have taken me back to my base at the Door to Darkness, which is where I'd like to set up the chicken farm. Oh, well. Ow. Hey, Step Zero, can you write a prediction, um, like a like a points betting thing, on how many chickens we'll get, and make the options one chicken, two chickens, three chickens, four chickens, five plus chickens, please.
I need to fill this hole in. I don't like an ominous hole by the back of the church. Catch the people sneaking in the back, but there are no back entrances, so it should be fine. And what if it's people checking out the garden, looking for the basil? Hey, Jacob. Good to see ya. Chicken prediction is up. Okay, so when I throw an egg, there is a chance that a chicken will hatch out of it. So the prediction is, chat, how many chickens will we get? Set it up here. How many eggs? Uh, 32, 48, 54. They have a 12.5% chance of hatching. Yep, that's why I grabbed so many. So bet your channel points. Math says six chickens. I am dubious. Math does say six chickens. It could also be every single one of them hatches into a chicken. It is not likely, but it is theoretically possible. Make sure the chicken's area is well lit so they can read. I say one chicken can't even start breeding them. Oh, that would be cruel. <sighs> With my luck, three. Mm. Well, we'll let the predictions be made. Cows, you're so loud. And there's so many of you. Hey, Squirrel Edge. Thank you so much for the gifts and sub to Breedy Bard. 
Hoi. I'm rooting for better luck, but also give the tracker a day. I'm not viciously expecting it. That's fair. Start her those chickens in potentia. Two. Three. Three. Who had three? <laughs> Some might say it's oddly specific. Hey, congrats on, on winning, Kit. You guessed correctly. Out of 54 eggs, we got three chickens. I have to pick the winner. Oh... Uh, hold on. The problem is if I exit out of Minecraft, it exits full screen. So, dang, the math is not math in today. It's really not. Uh, three chickens. Okay, I see the prediction. How do I put in the result? There's nowhere for me to put in the result. Fascinating. Twitch is a well-coded platform that runs well. I like how you labeled these two. Sad, one sad lonely chicken, two chickens start a farm, three chicken, four chickens lucky, five plus chicken streamer luck. No, that's... Is it in the request? I think you were the only one who guessed three, Kit. Yeah, you were. I just... Nothing I click is letting me close out the prediction. <laughs> well, if it is, it's not letting me. Like, I go to the... The challenges and predictions thing on the channel points reward. And then I can see the options. Yeah, 
There we go. That is weird. There we go. I found the thing. That was not... Heaven forbid it just be a button you be able to press. No, no, no. But congrats on Nana Kit, Kit TC, winning the prediction with three chickens. Oh dear, it's nighttime. Uh, let's put all this away here. I won. Do I get a chicken? I suppose you are winner, winner, chicken dinner, but uh, I think you have to collect your own chicken. I need to reorganize back here so badly. But yeah, when I clicked on, I can see the prediction under channel rewards myself. But it's weird that it wouldn't give me the option to select a winner from there. I feel like I have been able to do that in the past. Should I name the chickens Eins, Zwei, and Drei? I should have name tags in my uh, automated fishing area, after all. Yes? Okay. I'm gonna start cooking up some more beef. Now it's going to get really awkward when I've bred a whole lot of chickens, and then I go and harvest the chickens, like a crop. And then I go back and Eins and, and Dry are there, but Zvai is gone. We will be here the next chicken. <laughs> nah, I'd really rather Vindaloo it. I don't remember where this came from, but I remember someone basically not remembering how to say C'est la vie correctly, and it coming out sous la vue. I don't remember where that came from, but it made me giggle for like a week straight. Yeah, it really sucks. Sous la vue! Do I not have any name tags? Fire hook. I thought they were something you got from fishing. I certainly have plenty of fish.
C'est la vie is the more correct spelling, which is uniquely unhelpful when I'm talking out loud. We oui is oi. What can I say? She was probably just really into the uh, the mod scene. Just oi, 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 oi. I do not have any name tags. I could have sworn I had some. Do you have all the variants of Euro? Why, there's only one correct way and many incorrect ways. Yes, you are orange. Gyro gear loose. Euro gear loose. Why do we say Houston but not Hoos? Hey, Solver. Doing all right. Other computer has uh, kind of eaten plenty of dirt today, so hopefully going to be able to solve that problem soon and figure it out, but thank goodness for multiple computers to be able to work back up, right? Hope you're doing well. What happened? Its CPU just went burp, and uh, it doesn't turn on anymore. Okay, so next time, hopefully, definitely doesn't sound good. Yeah, have I tried exercising it? No, I'll take it to the gym later. Uh, next time, we'll complete this tower. And then we can start working on the facade, the upper windows, and the inner detailing where we want to put stairs. Kind of to help curve, smooth out these curves. So, but I feel like we made good progress. So, yeah, it is looking good. I'm going to call stream a little early today again, just, um, yeah, I'd like to do some work on the computer because it's hard to stream without it and I've got a wedding coming up and, you know, if, if I'm busy with the wedding, I can't be in the office. So trying to just do a little of everything. <laughs> oh, to be in two places at once. I haven't figured out how to buy a locate yet. But thank you so much for tuning in to Let Us Play. I've been your host, Father Evan. It's been good to be with you all today. Uh, join us again, hopefully on Monday, for more RPG Monday. Uh, continuing Kingdom Hearts 350 over two days. Tuesday, uh, finishing up five. Again, all God willing that everything gets working again. Um, more Midweek Minecraft and Rollercoast Tycoon for Thursday. Uh, that stream will probably be in the morning, if it happens at all. So keep an eye out on the Twitter and the Discord. I'll try to post some updates there about the computer, see what works, what doesn't. Um, and yeah, let's see about raiding. What was that one channel, Brit? Fantasy Forged? All right. Yeah, we'll raid into Fantasy Forged. Uh, they're playing some Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. It's a really fun game. I really enjoyed it when I played it. Uh, raid call is all glitches now belong to you. So go give them some love, and I hope everyone has a great rest of their day. 
And again, please keep an eye out on the Twitter and on the Discord for updates about future streams as figure things out. Ah. All will be well, all will be well, and all manner of things will be well. All right, but gonna send you on over, so take care and God bless.